Hi guys. Hello guys. Hope you're okay. Today it's the showtime number two. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. If you listen the first one, you probably know what it is. And if not, well, it's just basically what we like the past few weeks. Yeah. So today it's yeah, there is a YouTube podcast, music, Netflix. A Quite a lot. Thing. Yeah. So, so we should get start to it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So <laughs> we're starting with YouTube. So during these past months, what did you like on YouTube or what did you find interesting to watch? I didn't watch a lot of YouTube uh, this month. No, I'm just kidding. You know, <laughs> just uh, YouTube and Netflix, it's all my life. Uh, but I just didn't find, you know, um, the, the YouTube video or the... YouTube uh, channel yeah. yeah exactly just uh, not one particular there is just one uh, YouTube channel that I like but not like uh, I'm crazy off just like sometimes and this is the one of um, Montel Fish and I think by the way he he published a video last night anyway he does really check short it out <laughs> He does really short YouTube videos, like just sometimes just one minute or, you know, it's one, two, three minutes. Not... One minute? Yeah. YouTube and video? It, yeah, but let me explain. Okay. It's just, um, you know, he he shares he, his thoughts with us. And so it's like a, a diary and uh, he's just expressed his, himself about some topic and it's very chill very short but you can get his message quite quickly thanks to and that. does does he post a video every day or every two day since it is short videos uh not really i think it's it's more uh, you know when he he feel he had he has to talk about it oh okay maybe it's you know a mean to express and but just he... to move to move on after okay That's... and it's it, it's quite cool because uh it has inspired me to reflect on myself you know sometime sometimes and um especially when i i was not in a good mood uh during the end of january and so it was cool and really really short so you know one minute it's nothing so it's cool. like you can take also time with him to reflect on yourself yeah. and your thoughts. That's great. Yeah. And exa- and sometimes, you know, he he says uh, sentences and you're like, oh my God, this is my life. And yeah. You, <laughs> you really like can reflect on what's, what yeah. he's saying. That's and just great. And just in 60 seconds, you just say this sentence in, I don't know. I just like it just made your day and yeah. Can kind of completely change your yeah. your mindset. That's Sometimes really cool. it, it's kind of deep, you know. It's not really funny, and mm. but it's you know cool. Sometimes just to make I'll check it out. I'll yeah. check it out. Montel fish you? guys. Yeah. Okay. So um, this past this past months, I've been spending my whole life on YouTube, <laughs> um, just like the usual, you know, but more this past past months anyway so this okay in january we have this youtuber called ava jewel and she did a spe- like a special series on her channel called home in hawaii because she lives in oahu in hawaii like in the pacific island and that is very very great because we can see like the real life of a of a local living there she's showing us the multiple parts like the north shore the south shore and all the activities that we can do in hawaii uh the local restaurant how to uh, how to surf too because okay uh she had her friend invited in her video and um they went like surfing and that was really great so i've been watching also surfing videos don't ask me why. I don't even. <laughs> live, I don't even live in a in a place where there is um, the sea. So anyway, but you know, it is really great to see that. And also, 
uh, I want to travel to Hawaii so bad. Like, mm. really? I think. I yeah, you, you, you told me a few times. Yeah, like, um, I don't know if you know this YouTuber, but she's called Ellen Fisher. And she's a mom of, I don't know, four, four children. And she lives in Hawaii and she has her, her own garden and things like that. So that's, that's, yeah, that's the life I want to live, you know, I want to, <laughs> I want to live in Hawaii for, I don't know, like maybe six months just to yeah. explore and have like the beach and, you know, see how the people live there. So yeah, that was my, that was the um, YouTube channel I wanted to uh, talk about today. Let's be honest, Alex, it was hard to choose one. Yes. <laughs> Yes, it was hard because either either I'm watching vlogs, either I'm watching covers of songs, dances, yeah. or other other things. But yeah, this one really was in my top one. So okay. if Jules, go check her channels. Okay, so How that about... was the yeah. YouTube part. Let's yeah. go into the podcast. Podcast. Okay. Have you got anyone? I'm going to okay. I'm going to to start this one because oh my okay, god. Okay, okay, no problem. Sorry, guys, if you can hear my cat. I'm going to open the door for her. <laughs> okay, she didn't want to come, so <laughs> we're going back at plot at twist. It. <laughs> so the podcast, podcast. I've been discovering a new podcaster like every day, but also thanks to Leslie because I don't know how she does that, but every time she has a new podcast. And she's like, oh, go check it out. And I'm like, yeah, I liked it. So, yeah. So But you first... haven't finished the one that I recommend you like a few yeah. hours ago. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Because I'm like, oh my God, new things. So the first one I want to talk about is Get Real by um, BM, Peniel and Ashley. They are from the, the Team Dive Studios. And they are really great because it's just like um, random... Not random thoughts, but just normal people things that people do. So, for example, they talk about um, how it's how it's like to quit your home country to live in another one, um, to work because they are um, idols in Korea. Um, how like how do you say you love your loved ones, um, relationships, things, but also how to deal with um, anxiety or some things like that. So that was really great. And the other one I've been listening mm -hmm. is, I saw your tweet, are you okay? And this one, honestly, guys, oh my God. It's one of the best podcasts ever. Like they are so funny. I don't, I don't remember their names, but there are two. There is Jack, there is Jack, and there is oh Nicole, Nicole, yeah. yeah, Jack and Nicole, and they are so funny, and they have many stories, and yeah, that's that's really great. They are college graduates, and they just live their life, and mm. yeah. Just to let you know, guys, uh, Alex just uh, sometimes she shares me like some part of this podcast, and she just laughing like yeah. every time and i really feel like they're they are us and we are them yeah. because <laughs> we can relate to so much things like they i don't know like they're really funny and they're scream first of all they're, they're, they're screaming scream. every time also so that is very us that <laughs> also sorry um if we sometimes uh, shout in our podcast but we are just so excited you know to share it with you so yeah so i saw your tweet um, are you okay? You need to check this podcast out because it is really, really yeah. easy to listen. It's just take one hour and a half or one hour and 15 minutes. So just, just <laughs> yeah. And you do your thing, you know? So yeah. Mm. What, what about you? Well, I know Alex, you like, like a chill podcast, but I, yeah. I'm not like you. Sometimes I do like, a, you know, listen and some do some stuff uh but uh often um i like the podcast who which require which require um highest intention like not a lecture but kind of okay uh uh you know i prefer to listen to and really focus on what people say um 
so I tend to like more, for example, podcast about about personal development because I think it's a good way to learn about yourself, but mm -hmm. also about the the field uh, without even you know if you don't have time to, for read, for example, it's a good way. Or also, you know, when people uh, share their experience, uh, but you know, one hour and a half is really long. So if it's um, For example, I listen to a French French podcast, and uh, the girl who is kind of famous in France, which is um, Louise, mm -hmm, and my... she she makes uh, interviews, and you know it's about one hour, but it's okay because you learn so much about these people, and then after the next episode, it's another one. So, and I really like, but uh, because. Maybe, guys, you're not French. French, I'm going to share you one podcast in English. But I think uh, before yeah. that, you should maybe... Um, maybe some, some people want to know about her since she's French. So you can just, like, yeah. say the name for them. Uh, it's In Power. Kind of cool because it's in English. So <laughs> In Power. Uh, so it's in French. But if you want to learn uh, French, it's, it's maybe a good way. Uh, yeah. and it's really interesting because she's really young and you know she she created she has created created sorry her own um brand and you know she's i think she's 23 24 yeah maybe. she's really young <clears throat> she yeah. just finished her studies yeah. her studies yeah so she interviews many people and it can be really um different one from another yeah so i was really cool you know so good to get out yeah but uh, for the english podcast i really like the lavender lifestyle lifestyle podcast by i'm sorry if i, <laughs> if I say the wrong the name okay. in the wrong way it's i think it's aliens alien uh, zoo alien alien zoo zoo okay zoo. <laughs> sorry yeah. about that <laughs> yeah but um first i love her accent and let me tell you dudes uh when you're not a native speaker that is always something where she's from yeah and where she oh, yeah where she's from i don't know <laughs> really I gotta just, check uh... that out <laughs> <laughs> but uh i love her accent um and it's really cool yeah and also I enjoy literally every episode. You know, sometimes I listen podcasts, but not every episode. But mm. this one, it's never, it never, it never happened. Um, because she always uh, find finds a way to talk about different subjects with different people, and it's never boring. And I don't know, I just like it. You know. Yeah, gotta check that out too. <laughs> <laughs> The only thing make I'm a, saying make, right make, now, make, make a list and then yeah. check it out. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. So what? Um, listening to the Lavender Lifestyle podcast, then listening to that, then <laughs> listening to this. You guys, I have like 12 episodes in my Spotify playlist that I need to um, listen to, and all the episodes are like one and a one hour and a half. So that is okay. That do you want to know how much did I have to? listen like a few weeks ago 100 I, yeah probably 100 podcasts <laughs> and i was like how how and i just listen you know it's like people who talk in your mm. ears during all day so yeah okay so the next the next like um review not review yeah but we need to maybe section make yeah. um you know um a jingle yeah transition yeah, parts yeah for all that like the littles yeah uh, little parts no, 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 no. Go, music yeah. time <laughs> yeah we need to do that between like podcast netflix songs yeah. books yeah anyway <laughs> music so. time so alex okay this one was hard to yeah because again <laughs> Told you guys, the only thing I do in my life is listening to podcasts, going on YouTube and listening to music or playing music. So. In college also, you know, sometimes. Yeah, but, yeah sometimes. <laughs> not not every day there. 
So um, my song uh, is from a K-drama. Yes, I did watch a K-drama last month. <laughs> a big, a big improvement because um, I'm having a hard time to watch the, um, to watch series. So yeah. Anyway, so the song is called "Before Today Is Over" by ONF, and it is very, 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 very entertaining and great to listen. I wish I could like um, play as a, a, a part of the song, but um, I can't do that. So yeah, because I think it's gonna get copyrighted. <laughs> so. Get a get a ask Spotify for that. Anyway, so that is my song, <laughs> my song, my song of the month. Before today is over, and um, okay. I can't tell you what is it about because um, I can't understand Korean, and, and I did not listen, did, like did not um, read the yeah the lyrics. translation. So yeah. yeah, sorry guys. What is yours? Mine is an album. At the beginning, it was a single, but uh, then the album came out and the album is pink planet by pink sweet sweat i think it's sweat you know sweet it it's sweat? like for eating but uh yeah sweet, sweat. <laughs> <laughs> that was a... <laughs> not <Sorry>. the same thing <laughs> yeah pink sweat uh but if you just type pink planet i think you will uh, find it uh it came out it came out a few days ago and yeah like the whole album is cool I can't yeah. choose one, so you know that's probably the my my favorite album of the month. Uh, oh, I can't say that yeah. favorite album of the month. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, that Pink is sweats. it. I like I like this artist too. Um, mm. Willie Chen. And it's Willie young. Cole. I think he's young too. Yeah. I don't know anything about his life. Uh, but I think, you know, everybody is young in this world. Yeah. So. <laughs> and listening to his album is like feeling this summer, summer yeah, vibes, okay. chill vibes. Um, yeah. Okay. Beach okay, days. I need, I, I need to, I need to confess. Confess okay, time. Okay. Confession uh, time. <laughs> sometimes it's not a big deal. Sometimes, uh, sometimes on YouTube, I watch uh, videos um, who, you know, it's like you're in summer nights in a car and yeah, you're <laughs> i do that too that is the best feeling ever <laughs> and i love doing that and this album is just you know the, the perfect thing for that did people so, edit uh, the song like uh, you are in a car uh, driving on the highway I, I, um i don't know you know it, it came out like the 12th of february so maybe it's oh, okay. too young Oh, because okay. we we actually record this and it's the 22nd 20 20 second. yeah. yeah but yeah i do that too like i like the edits of you are in a concert all yeah. alone and uh the song <laughs> that's like you type is playing you are in a bathroom in a part uh, at a party you are driving on the highway blasting uh i don't know some she knows every music. title yeah um your neighbors are um are in a party next to your apartment and they are playing this song. That is so cool. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So the next section is Leslie's favorite section ever. Oh my God. Netflix. It is in my blood. Please come I on. I don't even have the words for like describing your love for Netflix. You, you know, know what? I, I have a friend who just uh, finished one series that I recommend, not in yeah. this podcast, but just to him. And it was the second time I recommend a series for him or the third one, the third time. I, yeah. I don't know. Anyway, and he he was just like, okay, that was cool. Okay. And he was like, what am I going to watch next? And I'm like, it depends. What do you want? <laughs> She's like, she knows everything on Netflix. And there is me. And uh, it's been a month since I've watched Netflix. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that's okay. You know, I'm going to do it for you. That's, yeah. She's so. got, like, I think I, I need to, you know, give, give, give her, give her, sorry, my, my screen. You know, when you can share screens, <laughs> like you can have mine because I, I'm never on Netflix. So, yeah. Anyway, so your recommendation. So you haven't anything 
you, Alex, you, nothing. Honestly, I don't have anything. I did watch some uh, Chinese, Taiwanese movies. Uh, and K-dramas, you said? No, that was not on Netflix. That oh. was on another platform called Viki. Okay, okay. So, yeah, I don't have anything for Netflix. Sorry, guys. But it's okay, okay. we have Leslie. Yeah, I have two things for you. Two things, sorry. Uh, it's uh, This month, it's, it's a French Netflix, you know. Uh, I have one series in one movie. Dum, let, dum, me talk, dum. Dum, dum, dum. <laughs> let me talk about the, the series. Uh, you probably heard about it. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Uh, in France, probably, you know, it's 100% my dad, sure. But <laughs> my dad did watch the series. Uh, okay, so this series is Lupin uh, by George K. and François Uzan. Hope that I'm French right. accent. <laughs> so Lupin, um, for those who do not know the series, it is inspired by the character of Arsène Lupin uh, in the books of Maurice Leblanc. I'm sorry, you know, it's French. So anyway, um, so it's a French series, as I said, like about a hundred times. And to be honest, and to be honest, I don't watch them a lot because... I'm not necessarily a fan of what French cinema presents, or maybe, you know, I just haven't watched the good series. <laughs> um, anyway, the main actor is, act it is Omar Sy, sorry. Really great uh, actor, by the way. Yeah, so he, an actor well-known in France and also abroad, and he plays the role of a gentleman Okay, I don't know how to pronounce it. B Boga, B I don't know. How to... I don't know. Burglar. Anyway. B U R G L A R. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> he stole things, but um, you know, in in a caramel. Oh my God, I don't know how to say that. Okay, anyway, okay. he he is a a charismatic. A, yeah, a, but a bad guy. But yeah. But the, yes. Okay, charismatic. Is that the is that the word in English? Char yeah. Charismatic. I think so. Charismatic. Yeah, maybe. Okay, and he his character is Asan Um So the shots are so beautiful, especially the first episode um, with the the Louvre, the museum. And so basically, what is the story about? Um, it's Asan who wants revenge on a family having wrongly accused his father of a necklace theft and who will com commit suicide in prison. Oh. Um, yeah, so this story, it is inspired by uh, the book, but it's not, it's, it is not the real story, right? Mm -hmm. It's just uh, an inspiration. Um, and yeah, I really like uh, this series, and especially if you like Paris, perfect for that. Uh, especially the first mm. episode because you can see the Louvre and you can see really many places. And I think you know there is this British touch um, oh. when it when it, it is filmed because it reminds me. Um, it reminded me um, uh, Bodyguard. I don't know if it's a. Uh, Is it's that probably... with Whitney Houston? No, no, no. <laughs> but, no, no, no. The wrong. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's uh, another series, a uh, bodyguard, uh, but not the movie with uh, oh, Whitney my... Houston. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, but um, if you know, you know, another series. If you want to watch Bodyguard on Netflix too, uh, and it's, I don't know. I just found really interesting the way of uh, French cinema mixed with the, um, the way British of British one. cinema. Yeah. But did like in this series, did they uh, portray Paris uh, like in those rom-com or no. did they show the real Paris? I, I think it's uh, like, it's not like uh, Emily in Paris with a lot of cliche. I yeah. didn't watch, but you know, you just have I to didn't watch, watch the, it too. You just have to watch the trailer. Yeah. And if you're French, you know, it's a cliche, but, um, uh, but they didn't show the real Paris, uh, because you know, 
I don't know first I don't know what is the real Paris I, I think for me the real that. Paris sorry is like not like in Emily in Paris yeah no no totally they okay they just uh, you know sh- shot uh, Paris, Paris like that you know okay yeah and um was... I did I don't know when they they shoot it but uh you know they they have they had sorry um Le Louvre yeah. just for them well and this is so huge there is not this is not in- complicated because <laughs> Right now, the Louvre is closed. Yeah, but so... I, I told you. Uh, oh, I but that was before. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, that was but, before. Uh, I watched also an interview by uh, of Omar Sy, and he, he just said uh, this uh, little story about like he was in front of um, the Joconde. Yeah, for oh fifteen God. minutes. Fifteen minutes. Yeah, and he was alone. Like the last time I saw, uh, like Joconde. he had he had a date with the Chokun. <laughs> <laughs> Can yes. you realize when when you go to the Louvre, uh, you can't really see the Chokun be- yeah. because there is there people. are so many people, and uh, you just spend two seconds there, took the take the picture, and, and go you're like, back. okay, here we go. That's it. Yeah, but uh, he was like he he didn't realize. Um, he was alone, and then 15 minutes later, someone oh. just say, hey, come on, come here, we have something to for you. That's so and, cool. And he was like, oh, I was alone. <laughs> I have a question for you. Yeah. Um, what would you do if you were alone in a museum like Le Louvre? Oh, my God, I don't know. I would uh, run everywhere. Run? I think I will do the same, you know, like run and uh dance okay i, need I will to play music this. yeah dance uh, and yeah. you know like uh dance like in um like in a, a music video yeah and uh you know just watch like do your oh, thing oh, yeah realize realize that you're alone you know be 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 in the present and they oh my god it's like when you are alone in a castle that would be so f- so much fun to do yeah like Okay, and especially like, the, yeah. the 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 Louvre, it is so beautiful. But yeah, uh, okay. <laughs> so that was and, your recommendation for Netflix, though. Okay. Oh, I just have one movie. Amazing. Yeah, because I know people are like, "Oh, series, not really." But the Lupin uh, is just five episodes, quite short. Yeah, but that's short. Uh, if you want a movie, a French movie, also, uh, it's the English title. It's not the same. Well kind of the same in french it's i'm not an easy man by eleonore puria uh we know that uh we live in a very patriarchal world where equality between men and women is not respected in the professional environment but not only yeah but not only uh i therefore find that this movie shares the message well without being moralistic you know, like being, oh, like okay. the society. Yeah. You know. They try um, to. Um, yeah, balance. Women, yeah, balance the thing. Find, yeah. find balance. And then like, ooh, look at you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> there really is, there, there really is a um, touch of uh, sarcastic humor. I like that. that. Helps to, to spread the message. And yeah, that is really cool. And basically, it's just a man who bumped his head to... Uh, something in the street and then um it was in paris too and then um he just he he's now in a word where women uh are more uh, there powerful than, than, yeah. than the men okay, yeah so. for example he realized this when for example in paris you have um the cimetière of père lachaise that okay yeah. Yeah. So Père Lachaise, and then when he wake when he woke up, it uh, was Mère Lachaise. Okay. So so okay. it was like uh, there is some like father was mother, and yeah. you know, like they changed the way. Okay, yeah. that's that's interesting. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, that was it. That was it. Thank you. That's- <laughs> Thank you, Netflix, for provide providing us some beautiful series. We really liked it. Uh, please 
put the Marvel um, films and movies on the French catalog. Thank you very yeah. much. <laughs> that would be gladly appreciated by the French population. Anyway, so uh, the last note that is the last section, yeah. which is quotes. Quotes. Just a little bit thing, you know. Uh, quotes. You know, you know, just to think maybe after a bit. I don't have any quotes. <laughs> really? <laughs> nothing. I have nothing. Did I had some something last time we did that? I don't even I, remember. I don't. I don't know if we um, did a quote, a quote section. Yeah. I don't have a quote. Anyway, I have a quote. Um, you have? <laughs> yeah, I always have. But um, it's uh, it was in the documentary The Secret. Uh, which maybe I will talk later, maybe not. We'll see. We'll see on Netflix too if you want to watch. Uh, but uh, <laughs> the quote is Do you treat yourself the way that you want other people to treat you? That is the question. And you know, it's like, a, I was like, My god, you know, so it's deep, yeah. <laughs> do, but yeah, that was just a quote like that, and I was like kind of interesting because sometimes you let people um do things uh for you that you won't tell that you won't uh, do yourself you know mm. for yourself so just uh reflect on it guys reflect yeah. on it don't let wow. people do do you some things that you don't you don't that can be it. actually that can be also uh the yeah. reverse thing you know yeah like, the sure. opposite, sorry. Yeah. Reverse. The heck. <laughs> oh, <laughs> also, I just reminded um, uh, on Netflix. Maybe you have. Oh, <laughs> you have Alex. You have watched. Uh, actually, we have. Uh, we All had the boys. To... I love yeah. before. <laughs> <laughs> but the the third one. Yeah, yeah, I don't know if you want to talk about it or not. Uh, yes, let's talk about it. Even if we are not in the movie section, but who cares? Yeah, we like it. anyway. Just oh yeah. So we watched um to all the boys I loved before, but um the last movie, which came February twelfth. So yeah, that was great. Um, and <laughs> we have this friend uh, who watched it <laughs> with us. And she's like, and actually, oh. it was it was Loiva, you know, one yeah, of her... Loiva, yeah, and she was a guest, and she was like, oh yeah, let's watch that, and then we were like, yeah. So did you, did you <laughs> see like the last two, the the two la the last two one? And she was like, what? There is two <laughs> movie before that movies before it was that? It, it was just like two minutes before we watched the movie and we're like, and we're like oh, can oh you remember God. what happened in the second movie because and, and she was like a second movie what <laughs> so she did watch the last one before the the two first ones so that was funny um what did i like about i this movie? I, I think you all know uh, the movie yeah like with um noah sentino and um her... okay you know i always forgot her name yeah let me that's so there's that this group it's um lana i think it's lana because yeah it's like wait, wait, lara okay. jean but lana wait wait wait, wait. okay let... my <laughs> internet is very slow okay let me check it okay. yeah uh, um, lana con okay lana condor yeah yeah lana condor Sorry for that, but uh, and you all know. Continue. So that she, was great. She is beautiful, by the way. Yeah, that was the a great way to end this uh, this series because mm -hmm. yeah, they they went to college, then they lived their life, and yeah, and that's it. No spoiler, please. <laughs> yeah, that's true because I don't know if people watched that. So yeah, so um, that was great, and. Um, yeah, that's that's the only thing I have to say about this. Yeah, that's cool, you know. We're all here to chat. Yeah, chat a little. And I think I think yeah, like um, uh, Noah and like I call by their name. Sorry, you're we're not, not Peter. <laughs> no, that, um, uh, Noah. Okay, okay, actors, just like okay, the okay. actors. Um, like Noah and um, Lana. 
uh they seems really they seem sorry they seem really cool like in real life to hang with and yeah have so, yeah just to say that you know <laughs> uh did you know that lena can sing yeah sure i saw that on ig and i was like yeah. what yeah so really well yeah can noah sing though <laughs> maybe you do a song together <laughs> <laughs> and it was really great to watch that, that movie because like it started in 2000 and oh yeah we 2000 were in and, high school in high school yeah 2020 uh 2019 anyway it was like four years ago i think so really um yeah 2017 because it was the second year of high school for us so that was in 2000 and <laughs> yeah you want to say I'm the confused. date i understand <laughs> i'm confused so that was great because like we we saw them grow with yes. us and i and i like that and that is why you know i like watch series who sorry which uh, are not finished yet because i know my dad don't doesn't really like it and he's like oh my god but what if it's cancelled and I'm like, mm. I don't care, you know, yeah. I just want to grow with the character. Yeah, that, that is, is the best thing to do. Yeah, and you're like, oh, yeah, I can relate, but no. But then, yeah. like, we were in high school and we watched this high school series, but yeah. it was in America, in the USA, sorry. And we we're like, oh, that that doesn't look like our high school. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Pretty sad. But uh it was I, I really like that. And I'm not like um I'm I'm not a big fan of um movie with a love story and I love you but I can't love you and then because my dad is going to kill me <laughs> if I anyway. But uh yeah, but uh, I just like this this um those movies. So yeah. I, I actually wanted to read the books before the two mm. last movie um was were released but uh, i can't i can't find it anywhere like yeah and i didn't want to buy the books yeah <laughs> and it's it's kind of expensive to books you know for but young I, people for I students wanna, i want to if i want to read a book i'm i want to go to the library or maybe second yeah. hand, second hand book you know on mm, the that it's probably not the type of book that you can find yeah. in the... so that's why i did not read it so yeah Anyway, so uh, guys, again, if you have anything to recommend or you want to chat or want to talk about, hashtag WUD on our IG or your post. Yeah, or... our IG. We forgot always to talk about our IG. Because okay. yeah, we did. We did have an I. We did have. Sorry. And yeah, Instagram. in the last episode, yeah. You will find this Instagram. <laughs> In the in the description of this episode. Yeah, sure. And actually, all of if you us... want, if you want to send a message to, it's yeah. Do that on Anchor though. We you have a link. Oh, Anchor or you know on IG. On, uh, yeah, yeah, IG. You know, it's you know direct mm, direct messages. It's in French. We forgot ah, always. is that? Is... <laughs> Wait. We always forget that. It's uh, anyway. Anyway, DMs. Uh... <laughs> I forgot that people can like really send DMs because uh, I don't do that often anyway. So yeah, our IG, the hashtag WUD and messages on Anchor. And also if you want to maybe put a, re a review, even if no one is listening to us. <laughs> but yeah, but okay. thank you. Yeah. Thank you anywhere for listening to us. I the know listener, we know, yeah, yeah, we know you. We You're appreciate here. you. And yeah, thanks, Jude. You you guys are our dudes. So yeah. Yeah. So we're going to say goodbye right now, and yeah, that's very sad. I know. And yeah. Uh, so bye bye, guys. Bye and have a good day. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye. bye.